Hey, Mike Riach here. I uh, own a company called Well Enable Integrated Health, and I teach a couple um, post-grad courses for movement man manual therapists. Um, one's called Dermal Neuromodulation, and it's like a, an, an evidence-informed approach to treating people with persistent pain. And then I teach another course called, it's a neurocentric approach to uh, massage therapy and manual therapy and and movement therapy <clears throat> and I've been asked why why do I teach these courses what got me into them and why should people take these courses and those are all really good questions and uh, maybe I'll start with what got me into it and so what got me into it was I started I started coming out of school with just knowing how to do manual therapy. I had a bit of an exercise therapy background actually. I did um, first year university sciences and then I went into human kinetics, kinesiology, and I did a couple years of that. And I wasn't really sure where I was going with that, so looking into different programs, I finally decided on massage therapy. And so coming out of school, I knew a lot of how to do kind of heavy pressure treatment because that was what we were taught um, after three years and we were taught that we fix bodies and bodies are broken and and it's our job to work on tissue we don't work on people <clears throat> and I found this approach sometimes worked and I found this approach often didn't work and I found this approach often made people worse or they couldn't take any of the treatment so I didn't know what to do I knew movement helped but people who are in a lot of persistent pain were either non-compliant or they couldn't move, it hurt to move, or they had a lot of beliefs around pain where they didn't want to move to get better. And so I had to look at other ways of helping these people or I just couldn't treat them. And so looking into what the research said, because I was pretty new to learn, learning a lot of the research, um, I discovered that I could email these people who wrote these papers and ask them questions. And I discovered there was whole sections of the internet where people would gather and talk about research around manual therapy and movement. And so I got to know some of these people, got them out to teach courses out in Vancouver, and it really changed how I looked at things. I learned a lot about pain, learned a lot about treating people more than treating patients or just treating bodies and how that all worked and how that was beneficial. So putting all that together, I decided that after taking Diane Jacobs course on DNM a few times and helping her teach it, I decided maybe I can teach this. And uh, I found a lot of people really enjoyed the course and a lot of people found a lot of help with it. And it's not really a course on technique. It's more a course on what is pain and how do we treat people with these like persistent pain issues or these tender spots without digging into them or causing them discomfort and, and really working in a way that I had to work way less, with way less effort, um, more using my brain than using, using my body to put pressure on things. And uh, people got longer lasting relief. And I could also predict relief and I could predict treatment times and stuff. So I found it way, way more helpful for myself. And hopefully the students do too. I think sometimes I leave them with a bit of questions after, which is okay. And I'm always open to follow up emails and questions and things like that. Um, and then with the neurocentric approach, I kind of combine another therapist, Barrett Dorco, his work with... Um, simple contact, which is really getting the body to move in a way that expresses itself and re reduces uh, muscle tension and reduces discomfort and getting kind of giving bodies permission to move again. I find it's really helpful with people who've got ongoing kind of chronic pain, but also people who kind of hold tension in their body too often and because of other issues. Um, and it's not the only way to treat people. These techniques, but I find they're very helpful for me. And then I combine that, Barrett Dorco 
simple contact with um, kind of the neurodynamic stuff, which is from Michael Shacklock and David Butler and that group of people. And um, kind of moving the limbs around, moving the spinal components around in a way that the target is the nervous system, getting the nervous system to have theoretically less inflammation around the nerve, maybe. We're definitely not sliding and gliding them. Um, we're maybe putting a bit of tension in the nerve, which might reduce inflammation, maybe. And uh, we're helping them, their brains feel safer with movement. And those are the courses I teach, and uh, I think they're a really good foundation for any manual therapist or movement therapist um, who wants to help people who've got pain complaints or ongoing pain complaints. It doesn't work with every condition that's painful. Um, and we talk about that, we talk about the different origins of pain, and um, I think I think it's really, I do it for the patients too, if you can help more people in your career, and they can stay good until the next injury that is unrelated to the old injury, but they stop coming in every month, every week, every six weeks, or treatment because they are not relying on you to get better. They are now able to look after themselves. I think that's a big component of it. Yeah, so that's what I do. All right, happy to answer any questions. Um, talk to you guys later. Bye.